yeah, this makes sense because it can only output 240 units with only two of these. Add a third, and then we're up against the uh, 166.5 there. So yeah, this should be able to feed actually another one of these completely. And yeah, we've got we've got sand. It's moving. It is moving uh, consistently. There's that one, and there's excuse me. Ah, yes, uh, it's it's got that there now. So we have a 81% enriched, enriched uranium. Uh, that just leaves two more things. The agitator needs to agitate and give some wonderful 83% from 81. Uh, I'll just do that to give it uh, a bunch of those. Just add ammonia. Just add the beautiful ammonia. Yes, beautiful and glorious ammonia. Uh, you're going to go there. I have decided that is where you shall live. Right there. Ammonia! Ammonia is another thing that I have moduled the hell out of, along with the uh, organic solvent stuffs, so that I have... Enough! I have enough of these things. Uh, and that just leaves the final step of giving a yellow cake by adding the biofilm, which is right over here. Going up. Up, 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 and away. Of course I'm too low. Again. By one tile. Just add stuffs, add, uh, you need a tailings out, uh, a few units of tailings out, and then it's just, you know, add stuff. Yellow cake! Oh, right, I need to uh, deal with this. There's two varieties of this recipe, isn't there? Yes, that's supposed to be the not enrich, the not uranium waste? Where's the... Or do I even have access to that in this thingy? Probably not, but yeah, we'll just get rid of this stuff. So this is involved in vanadium. Gives a fairly easy way of getting into vanadium. Yeah, that's better, but not quite perfect. We need uh, even more. Even more are required to fully output. Now, this is a short enough pipe that uh, it is capable of getting rid of more than 1,200 units per second, just because of how few segments of pipe this is, it this is fine. It can totally only be limited by the amount of sand coming in. And we have a we have a few units of sand coming in. Just a just a few. Just a few. So we have yellow cake now. Beautiful and glorious yellow cake. Uh, it will need to load a train. And then we can move on with our wonderful uh, glorious li lives. Where why why do I choose the worst of spots go that way and then go down you go down all the way to here and then over there and there and yes the, the belts are so fast they look like they're going backwards that's that's the idea here. These these belts are so fast, they look like they are going in reverse. Although the arrow is pointing in the opposite direction of the motion. So, do bear in mind, these are just so fast that they look like they are going backwards. Okay, this train uh, is going to be limited to one singular stack each. 
uh, of this yellow cake because yellow cake stacks to 500 units. And these these trains will be moving a thousand units of yellow cake at a time. All right. Need to pull them out first. Uh, so there's like some issues. Why do I keep ending up finding tired Ulrich in this stupid thing? I don't I don't understand. Uh, this is I think somewhat incapable of actually pulling stuff from the trunk. It's, it seems a little iffy with being able to pull things out of the trunk. Uh, specifically modules, I've noticed. If I'm trying to uh, paste buildings down, it won't start by pulling from what's in the trunk. It'll pull up from my inventory, and then when I'm out of the stuff from my inventory, it, it won't see stuff that's the modules that are in the trunk. It's a little weird. A little bit weird. Uh, at times. Now, how long is this going to take? I got no idea. But, yeah, you. You are a uh, yellow cake station. Yellow! Yellow cake to depot once you are full. And then circuit condition, and you can do your thing. Huzzah! We did it. We did that thing. And I don't think I have it set yet. So... Just set yellow cake. It's actually one word there, but no matter. Yellow cake. There we go. It has been assigned. Now again, I have I have no idea how long this will take. Yes, in the trunk of the dragon. In the in the bag that it it's carrying in my this isn't a dragon, by the way. This is a this is totally a tiger with bat wings and a scorpion tail. It is a tiger with bat wings and a scorpion tail, tipped tail. So how is this doing? Do I want faster output? I think so. Faster output is more stuff. More stuff. It will not be that easy to do more stuff. Uh, more sand, I should say. Because of the tailings. That is that is the biggest uh, issue, is the tailings. Uh, and the reason, the reason I say that is that uh, too many output of tailings, and I have to do this on the other side, basically. Uh, and then that's the sand output. More sand. More. All of the sand. Um, I actually need some here, too. Whoops. Some more here, too. There we go. Now we're limited by stops, and this is now flowing a lot faster. It is flowing, and it is, yes, now that is full. Good, 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 good. And because I have the limitation on the bulk rail loader to only hold on to a full stack at a time uh, in each of the loaders, um, the yellow cake can back up and then focus all of the production on the 70% uh, uranium powder. To the mall! We go, we go. To the mall. For wonderful things. Uh, so that's all of that stuff done. Like, that's, that is that. So now it's just place buildings, do some logistics, and we're 
We're done. Also, I'm getting chased down by... By my bots. My bots! Glorious bots! I have... By the way, I have uh, 17,000 available high-tech Logibots, uh, of which it looks like less than 5,000 of them are actually working right now. And then I have 2,097 of the high-tech Constructo bots. Just to give ideas of how things are going there. Oh, the free, yes, bring me things. Bring me all of the things that I don't really need anymore. All these, all these scrubbers I don't need anymore. Beautiful, wonderful, various scrubbers and agitators. I don't, I don't need those. I do not need those. Okay, what is my next station? It looks like I am now forced into here, so... Mm. Yeah, this this is actually my next station. This is Mall Yellow Cake. That is the one. Oh, that is the one! You are going to be limited to... Yeah, that. Uh, and you are... That... Stuff there. And the train is on its way. Huzzah! That is the yellow cake done. And brought to them all. Now, Bose Einstein Superfluid is the first item on this list. It uses liquid helium and deuterium. Well, I have both of these things right in here, right? So let's go ahead and uh, grab some of that. I have deuterium being made right here, with uh, the liquid helium right in here, and this is done in a nanomaterial factory, so it can be placed down nearby, let's say right there, to make this stuff, this beautiful, glorious stuff, productively. Bear in mind that I have Mark III on some of these buildings that do have productivity modules. Once they are at Mark IV, they will have uh, a few more. A few more of those modules. Uh, let's see. They'll have they'll have double the modules. It's uh, it's pretty nice. Uh, so that's the, uh, the liquid helium. Uh, and the deuterium is right there. Place some uh, inputs and outputs as well as some power, and that is Bose Einstein Superfluid. Just to click that a couple more times. Uh, it's using, of course, heavy fermion material, which is, you know, 70% uranium powder. And uh, that's done. Pretty easy. Next, I need a. Oh, I'm not. I didn't tell myself to. I didn't say give me stuffs. I didn't tell them to give me things. I need things. I need electronics factories. Bring me. Give. Gib factories. I need these. I need, I need them. Because the next thing that we are making is the Varfi Josephson Junction. The Varfi Josephson Junction. This uses a whole bunch of things we already have. Does the Ocula work now? Uh, considering I haven't updated the game, uh, not for me. Uh, it should work on exist. It should work on new saves that were made after the fix, I guess. But yeah, th my save does not work with uh, with the Ocula. It crashes when they bring stuff to me. Let's uh, let's attempt not to break the game in the meantime, as I as I continue to do these things. So Varfi Josephson. Having Mark IV with all of the glorious stuff. Yeah, this is just a matter of request the things, and that is that. Ta-da! Next, we've got the Quantum Vortex Storage System. This needs contained strangelets, so I need slaughterhouses. I need a slaughterhouse, a slaughterhouse, taking antelope, and doing the, the uh, contained strangelets. 
it does not give back cages, sadly. But that'll be the thing that I need going forward. Uh, so that is that thing. Now I can place down uh, this to give me uh, these productively. And another matter of just place the things. Am I getting all of my science the way it is intended or through that brain? All of my science is through the way that it is intended. The normal method. Everything is normal. I have not... Well, at this point in time, everything is normal. But during the entire process of getting here, yes, I did vat brain for blue science, chemical science. I did vat brain, I think... Do you... Is it? Is there a pie one? I've forgotten. Uh, I, I have done vat brain stuff. The only thing I didn't do any vat brain for is the utility science. Um... Just because the utility science vat brain recipe requires gene transfer agent, and it's sort of like by the time you get the gene transfer agent, you're sort of already working on your regular utility science anyway. You're practically there. It's place the stuff down to make the creatures you need to make to do the perfect samples. You are in the process of making perfect samples, and that is basically it. You're done. I, For me, it seemed a little bit too closely timed, so I just skipped it entirely. Uh, so yeah, that's these things. Quantum Vortex and, uh, you know, the Varfi Josephsons. Plenty of contained strangelets happening. Uh, yeah, that's that done. The next is a first of three particle accelerators. Uh, so you know what? I'm just going to uh, plop down three particle accelerators where I, wherever I have the space to plop down three particle accelerators in a neat little line. Uh, that's unfortunately one tile off. Three particle accelerators in a neat little line. Let's do it. Can't do it there. Nope. Can do it uh, there. One, two, and three. We've got quantum dots, we've got nitrogen vacancy centers, and we've got the uh, a antimatter. Yes, antimatter. Which has a fuel value of 40 gigajoules when used as a uh, nuclear fuel. The way I played the game at a point, I got all the sciences at very similar times. Well, the uh, it was it's like that with utility. I got the utility science uh, pretty close to. Uh, I got the ability to do the vat brain utility science pretty close to where I could get the actual utility science. The chemical science vat brain. Uh, came well before I was able to make actual chemical science. Uh, same same with all of the other stuff. The purple science came a little bit uh, little bit early as well. That was basically just the next stream. I set up the actual purple science. So they those were pretty close as well. Uh, I need phosphine, boric acid, and etching solution uh, right now. So I'm going to go hunting. For them, I think I have them. What are you supposed to be? I don't even know. Uh, I should have some of these ish nearby. Maybe not the uh, etching, I don't think, but one of the above. Maybe. Maybe. No, I'm not. I'm not seeing. I don't see them. I think all three of these are, like, fresh, new to this area of the base. Wow. New things to this area. There really isn't, like, a boric acid that gets used over here? In, in like, this stuff? No. There, there is not. 
Oh yeah, I'm making a few more uh, petri dishes. Just uh, just a few more, right uh, right in here, uh, for things. For things, growth factor, uh, in particular. Yeah, I could have sworn something in here used boric. In here. My memory is failing me. How about in this stuff? This stuff... Canalgas and other things? No Bork. Wow. Huh. Alright. Well then. Uh, Bork. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. These, these things. Uh, we're gonna be doing stuff after we this uh, space science going. We're, we're going to be looking at some of the other things available to us once uh, once we get that. Alright, uh, so boric acid is all the way over here. Hello, there it is. There it is going into there that I know of. So I can take that line. Which one's that line again? That's uh, the middle. Etching solution is actually right nearby there as well as the the phosphine i think i needed that on the well, i know that i need that on the dope silicon would help if i could spell uh so the phosphine yeah should be on the light end dope silicon up over here uh so i need to bring this phosphine from here to there so right right up in here, right right here, down to here. And I need to be in boric acid and etching solution, which are being used on stuff together over in this general vicinity, also over to here. So for now, bring all three of these over. And then oddly enough, it is the it is the one on the bottom that's going to need to go up first. But I will take all three of them over as far as I effectively can before worrying about where things come in from. Let's start with the phosphine. Um, where where are you? I'm trying to get 60 FPM. Am I going to be moving the things out of the mall and into? different factories. Well, as it turns out, uh, I am already producing one science per second of everything but the space science. Uh, so, so as it turns out, my base is already doing one SPM of at least of everything but the space science with the stuff in the mall already. So, yeah, yeah. Because uh, I sort of built the utility science already at that level. At that level. Alright, here's the phosphine. It needs to go down. So the, the, the concept of having one SPM as a goal, as it turns out, is actually a, with, with the mods that I have now, the, uh, the Bob's mods in particular, modules, uh, that actually could allow me to go further than the uh, the one SPM uh, and still have some level of ability to do things. Still be able to have performance in the game because that's the. Uh, that's the main issue, is just having performance. Can that go a little further? Yes, it can. Uh, I think it's the bottom. Let me let me see. Yes, it is. It is the bottom one. And these two can uh, attempt to continue. I think I have to uh, adjust the one here in the middle. A little bit because I'm pretty sure I can't jump all the way over there 
Uh, the middle one being, I think, the boric acid. So, yeah, about that. I'm actually just going to bring that down a bit. Uh, and go over with it from there. Uh, so I still have elements of my bus. We can we can have a look at the entirety of the base once I finish setting this up, uh, actually. So just hold on. We'll we'll get to showing off the entirety of the base as it currently exists. All right. So where's all that stuff again? Uh, I know that I needed boric acid up here for you. Yeah, there's uh, there's some boric. There. Oh, hey, the uh, Boric. Yeah, hi. I don't, I don't need to bring you down from there. That's that's where you are. Boric, Boric, Boric. Right there. You go. And then, at least I'm I'm pretty sure that's that's the one. Yes, that's the one. And then etching. Beautiful, wonderful etching solution. That is over yeah you hello hello nems nano electrical mechanical systems that was using it and there's etching so yeah there's there's some stuff on the bus that is being used in particular the rubber and the latex. Uh, the rubber and the latex are primarily what's remaining from the main m bus that I'm actually using. Uh, and elements from here, like the formaldehyde, I'm using that too. But I'm not actually using any of the circuit stuff here, at least not the actual circuits. The circuit elements technically are going to the mall, but I am producing all of them in the mall already. So really, none of this stuff needs to exist. The resin I am using, the uh, I think the fiber board has been replaced. I can get rid of that. I can get rid of all of this. Although, I sort of am using some of that uh, urea. Really, the, the big ones are the rubber and the latex that I'm still using from them all. Any whoozle, that's that one taken care of. All that uh, stupendous pipe logistic stuff. Right, uh, stuffs, things, give me those things, give me those things, do that, do that, and do that. Strangelets, yeah, another thing, another thing using the strangelets. Oh yeah, silicon wafers. That's uh, going to be some demand for stuffs. All right, come on, production block. I am now doing that, that, and that, uh, which just leaves the pie, Josephson, which is a uh, place the electronics factory again, which is just placed in the electronics factory with uh, the input output stuffs. And Pi Josephson with uh, with those things. Yeah, those things are pretty good to have. Uh, and with all of those items placed now to make space science, uh, I can now officially make every single Mark IV building that exists. Every, every single Mark IV building is now able to be made now that I have uh, all of these things. Like the Bose Einstein and the Pi Josephson. Looks like I need to do a little bit more liquid helium, but that's fine. Could just speed up that building, I guess. 
that uh, that's making that liquid helium. Uh, so now it's just like place a few quantum computers. Where do I want to actually do my quantum computing? That's a that's a good question. Where do I really want to just do this quantum computing? Somewhere I can fit eight of these. Uh, uh, stop, Alexa. Stop. Yeah. Why? Why did it think that I was calling its name? I'm not. I'm not calling its name. I am not. Uh, oh, this also uses liquid helium. So that. Yeah, that gives me some indication of where to put this. I guess somewhere where I have liquid helium would be uh, a great place. Probably along these lines. Yeah. Somewhere along these lines. Now I will, of course, not actually place eight of these. Uh, that sounds like an awful idea to place eight of these. Uh, this has a building limitation, I'm pretty sure. Um, oh, hello. I was expecting this to have a building limitation on productivity. Uh, so that changes a little. That, that changes a little. You know, because all of the... Will have, yes, will have a building level limitation on productivity at some point, but not right now. The, uh, the research centers have limitations on that, uh, on the use of productivity for everything in the research centers, which is why I was expecting the same here. Uh, how much vacuum? 111.2? Yeah, that's plenty. Uh, do, do, do. Beacons! Level 3. So, Bob's Modules Beacon Mark 3s. Oh my, would you... Like, look, look at that effect area on the... On the level three beacons just like oh god goodness it's so much beaconing that you can do and what's even better is that uh they sort of have s the ability to do 100 percent effect transmission so the full effect of the modules gets transmitted and they each take six slots i'm doing quantum computing right now Right now, I am not quite far from quantum from quantum computing. We are, we are, we are quantum computing right the hell now. There it goes. We've got space science. Also, where's my windscreen? Because that's the wind state. I've I have done the thing. That's that's the win state, technically. I I don't know why it didn't just trigger, but hey, we're we're doing it. We're doing it, we've won. Tech we've won the game. We have we have we have space science here. We can we can do a space program because guess what? This exists in the game at this point. These these things exist. I don't know what they exist for, but they exist. I don't know if the game will crash if I take this, but sure. Yes, one as in barely started. Yeah, barely, barely started. So it looks like I need to figure out this liquid helium situation uh, that's going on. Uh, helium. Liquid helium. Wherefore art thou? Where is that li liquid helium? Right there oh day liquid helium hello you are flowing uh, I'm going to take this off uh, put it two tiles away and stick a stick a doohickey there now as it turns out, I'm pretty sure this is actually limited to, to uh, 6,000 uh, per second that it uh, voids. I think that's the limit. Or is it 60,000? I've completely forgotten. Uh, 
Yeah, beacon. Bacon time. Time for all of the bacon on the planet. Yeah, you upgrade those, get more effect transmission. Yeah, that's a little bit better. Now it's how much water can I throw at it? That's a that's another good point. So that's fully saturated both of those. Uh, this means I have to. Oh really? I have a thing there going to absolutely nothing. Uh, let's see. I have to break some of this. Uh, because I need room for... Oops. Yeah, I need, I need room for pipe to ground. As well as pipe. Did I just screw myself out of getting into the vehicle? Yes, I have. That's a slight issue, by the way. If you, if you build under your vehicle, you could end up without the vehicle. Yes, next up is Pi Space Life. That's that's totally a thing. By, by the way, uh, if you have not been aware of the updates recently uh, with stuff and things, uh, I can move that. I can place that there, and I can actually just place this down further. Uh, there's work being done towards a quote-unquote pi space program type stuff as in having a space exploration style of map like actual surface that is space space block pi block style of things where you build out your space platform place down the platforms like landfill and uh just build stuff in space and do stuff in space like that's going to be the replacement i'm sure for doing the cosmic space dingrit stuff that uh, that will be that uh let's see so this is moving enough looks like this is actually voiding what it needs to void which is good very very nice and this is also providing what it needs to provide uh for the water it looks like it's pumping 7200 so i am still limited yeah because that's uh five six that's six yeah six is 7200 there's only one more input port here so yeah that's there and that still not quite enough because i think that's 90 that's 84 8400 of the 90 nine so whatever it's fine we should be we should be able to produce stuffs it's still not enough really really 30.3 wow well at that point at this point i would need another i need another building to uh to continue this uh or a mark four but no that won't that won't work that's just speed uh, yeah, so I'm, I'm gonna grab you. I'm gonna get rid of all that. That. Those extra little bits and bobs. All that extra shenaniganry from this. Hit save. No, I don't, I don't need that Helmont Smart Tool, thanks. And yeah, we'll, we'll put this like here, like right here. The bots will do their bot things. I just need the helium brought in and the liquid helium sent out. Chances are I don't actually have the helium production for all this, but yeah, all this is just about, you know, getting all of the uh, production. Gasoline?
I must have broken something. Thank you.